What's up and welcome back to the channel, my name is Greg and here we solve puzzles, enjoy puzzles, do everything about puzzles and sometimes even videos that don't relate to puzzles, but usually it's only puzzles. Today I've got a super satisfying puzzle, in fact it's one of the most satisfying puzzles I solved last year, I mean this year, but the year has only started. Super satisfying puzzle, it's called the Labyrinth Puzzle, the goal of this puzzle is to pack all the pieces inside of a tray. It is kind of a combination between a jigsaw puzzle and an assembly puzzle. The satisfaction is unreal. Before we go into the solution of this puzzle, I just want to say that I have a coupon code of mine called Wanderer. Put this coupon code in escapeworld.com to get 10% off your entire order on their website. So if you want to get this puzzle, link will be in the video description and let's start solving this puzzle. Okay. Ooh. This looks nice. And we will take it apart. I'm not looking at the pieces. I'm gonna mix everything up and with closed eyes right now. Don't wanna see anything here. Okay, it looks like we're good to go. Don't even know where to start. Let's just start the timer and start solving this puzzle. No idea where to start with this puzzle, honestly. No idea. Thing to the sides like this um, I guess starting with the center would make sense like this so I have the center and I can put this piece here I can also put this piece right here this actually fits pretty well so this would be our start uh, then looking for the next center piece this looks like a good start with the center. Let's move the pieces far from the center to the side because now we won't be needing them. And this now fits really well to the center as well. The logic here is to start with the center pieces because there are less possibilities because the circles are smaller. So there are less pieces that will be in those circles. From here we can actually progress with bigger circles. This is uh, maybe too big for us now. We need something smaller. I think this would, yeah, this would fit really good. No, no. Oh, yeah, most likely this circle fits here well. This is too big. Oh, this is a quite small one. And this can fit. Yeah, this is the only place I think this would fit in. Next up, this one fits here perfectly, right? Very satisfying, as you can see, we are in a pretty good shape. So this is not possible here. How about this? No. Hmm, looking for a small enough circle. I think this would do the job. Not here, not here, but here it actually should do the job. Yeah, this fits here quite nicely. Oh, what? Very small piece, actually. Two very small pieces. This one is here for sure. This one probably will be here, but I need to find the other small one. There's this, which is small, and there's this, which is pretty small. I think this is small enough for us. Good. But this one is really, like, tiny. Yeah, it can be at many places. Uh, so because this is so small, we will leave it in the side for now. This is possible here. This is not possible here. And this might be possible here here as well so uh, because this has two possibilities I can't put it as of now this might be in a good size probably too big for now okay it's about this this fits here quite well this doesn't fit here so it can either fit here or it can also fit here do we have a piece that fits here like that let's see yeah, this piece of two parts, this is two parts, no won't work. Okay, so this means that this piece is 100% here, no doubt about this. Uh, but I'm trying to find a small, oh, uh, what about this? Is this here? Yeah, okay, okay, good. But now we can find something really tiny. Here we, we have this small fraction of the circle that will fit here quite nicely. Oh, nice. This is very, very chill. A good puzzle to do when you're stressed or something because this is so satisfying. I think this could fit here, but no, I thought it would, but it's not the correct size. Oh, nice! This is a good one. This fits well. Nope. Probably not this. Maybe this. Yeah, no. Maybe this, actually? No, it's too big. 
Hmm, nothing fits here, which is uh, a red flag. Maybe I did a mistake sometime. Only after I tried everything, I can tell if I made a mistake or not. Okay, okay, this is, this is what I did try, all right. Good, fits pretty well. Now this one, this is a nice fit too. And this is a nice fit as well. Okay. This is a good fit as well. The more I go out of the center, the puzzle becomes more difficult actually. Okay, no, no. Yeah. Nope. No, I really can't find this one. I really... Oh no, oh no, 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 no. Oh no, did I make a mistake? Do we have a problem and I need to start over? I hope not. Let's figure this thing out. I think we have this here, this is pretty obvious. And then we have this little part. We have two that can fit here. This will not, but this probably will. Good. Now, this here is strange. Because I tried so many different parts here and nothing actually fit. Maybe it's this that has to be here. It will be very strange if that's the piece. Let's assume it's not it. Actually, I'm looking at this part now and I don't see anything that's outside that can actually fit inside this. Literally nothing can fit inside of it. Which means that you probably have a piece in the wrong position. Probably one of these pieces. Which one of those is in the wrong position? Because even though it looks like... Oh! 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 No! No! It's just that this is here. Okay! 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 That, that explains a lot of things. Good. Okay. <laughs> so maybe we still have a chance to find this somewhere here. Maybe we are actually not wrong. I'm just gonna try everything I have. Literally everything I have. Okay, so I have this. Do I have anything else that could fit the same way? Let's check this. No. No, it looks like this is the only part that could fit here the way it fits. What if I try... Okay, no, this is the only part that can fit here. Now I will have to find this one again. Maybe this one? Yeah, perfect fit. This is uh, stumping. The toughest part of this puzzle so far. Oh, nice! That's a good fit. I found this. Let's see if something fits here. Uh, let's start with the longest parts first, and then we can quite easily determine where everything has to be. We can also start by doing things like this. No, you know what? Change of plans. Let's find this one first. This is it. This is the correct piece. Now we have a double piece right here. Can this be here? No, this cannot be there. But this can be here. We'll need to spin most of this structure. Then I can put this here. I'm gonna find all of those now. And is this good? I think it is. If I can find this one, then this is the correct position for the whole circle. But if not, then I actually have to find something else. Yeah, okay. So I need to actually spin this and this piece will have to be right here. Now here, I will just try to find the... Oh, nice, okay. So this means that the circle is in the correct position now. For sure, this is how the circle should be. Now let's start with the bigger pieces. It's a big piece. It will fit only here. Only place for this piece. This piece will fit only here because it's the longest one. Good. This piece will fit only here. This big one is only here because it has this. And this piece only here. This fits right here. This fits right here. And the difficult piece is indeed the last one. And put it here. Small tiny piece. So satisfying. Oh my god. 25 minutes. Oof. That was an interesting one. It's more of a jigsaw puzzle, but with logic. In the beginning, I started from the middle and started building up from there. I had to use a lot of logic, but also it has some kind of jigsaw element. So I just had to find the correct piece every time, and slowly build everything up. Wow, so fun. So satisfying. This puzzle is solved. The satisfaction of this puzzle is on. 
real. I would replace my uh, meditations with this puzzle. Actually, not, <laughs> not meditating enough, but this was so meditative. I really like these kind of puzzles because you get into them if you're in a, a chill enough position, chill enough spot, you really calm yourself with putting the pieces inside. And this happens with jigsaw puzzles as well. This puzzle is just more on the mechanical puzzle spectrum, I guess, rather than jigsaw puzzle spectrum. This was enormous fun to solve. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please like and subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!